we got over that's, here? Um, this is um, Benny the Butcher and um, Freddie Gibbs. It's Freddie Gibbs right here. That's his baby mom. That's Freddie Gibbs and his baby's mom. But then the other day, Benny the Butcher put a, a picture up. His his B, baby mom put a picture up with Benny the Butcher. Oh, the baby's mom put the picture She's up. She's the one who posted oh, the picture. Oh, man. The baby's mom put the picture up with Benny the Butcher. Now, if y'all don't know the history between them, um, Freddie Gibbs and Benny the Butcher got um a history that they don't like each other. When Freddie Gibbs went to Buffalo, where Benny the Butcher is from, for a show, he was out with her, his baby mom. Oh, he was with her then. She was, she was out there with as well. So she witnessed the ass Witness, whooping. She was oh, there. She even man. squared up with somebody. There was oh, some flicks and squaring up. But he got jumped, got all knotted up, got his chain took, the whole nine. And now, however long later, a year, two years maybe, she with the guy who's your enemy? This is the video right here he's talking about. In case, in case you haven't seen this video, this is what happened. Who do you throw at? Oh, yeah, that's in the Where restaurant they were there. Look at all these people. They in there handling the boy. Damn. Took his chain out of up. I will say, though, that's that's extreme for all them people to go at one person. You know what I'm saying? Like, that, that's a little bit extreme. Like, I don't know what he did. Unless he did some super disrespectful stuff, that's different. But yeah, I don't know the history all of those people for beef, one person but... is kind of crazy. But if she was, if she, you said she was there when that happened. That's she what you're was saying. there when it happened. My whole thing is. The reason I wanted to talk about this topic is, should you be loyal to your significant other even when you ain't cool? And it's not even just your significant other. You got a child together. You share a child together. So no matter what, is that... I need well, I so need answers. When you say loyal, it kind of it's kind of like a broad picture because loyal means like you're just thinking loyal, but in this specific situation... This is more than just loyal, because this is like specific to an incident. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. Because of course, of course, if, you're, if once you move on, you don't just stay loyal as far as not moving on. Of course, you move on with other people when y'all ain't together. But in this case, being specifically loyal to the situation, like of these people that did something right. to, to him, somebody who got issues that got with your issues baby with father. Him. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, okay, y'all not together. Y'all don't live together. I don't know if they ever live together, but y'all share a child together. At the end of the day, if something happens to him, your child will no longer have a biological father. And and I mean, do you think of course with the, I mean this this is the thing. If you if you make a chick mad, you got to expect any anything could happen. You piss a chick off, a lot of chicks do stuff like this on purpose. You know what I'm saying? A lot of chicks will purposely seek out your family or your friends or people that you that you mess with your boys specifically like to try I to, said, to she, get back at she you. She posted the picture. And she posted the picture, so did Freddie Gibbs do something to her? So that because that changes it, you know what I'm saying? If he violated her, say say he messed, smashed one of her friends or her cousin or something like that, or her sister or something. And this is all gloves off. It's all gloves off. You kind of can't blame her if he, you know what I'm saying? If he did something like that to her, because I mean, people that's what they've been in the turmoil for a while. I heard. Um, first off, if you don't want a chick, you don't think she's suitable to be your child's mother. You shouldn't really be messing. That's first. So she's a porn, I don't know, I don't want to call her a porn star, but she's a porn actress from what I heard, from what I read. And um, there was issues because she continued to do porn while she was pregnant with his child. While she was pregnant? While she was pregnant. And I heard one of her wow. excuses was, mm, mm, mm. well, he ain't taking care of my bills. So well, I'm going to quit doing what I'm doing. But why are you pregnant though? Why are you pregnant? Like you couldn't just switch up and get another job. Man, it's crazy so, out here, man. I never knock nobody's hustle, whatever they do, but just just for your own self, like respect. If you have a baby inside you, to still you're saying she's doing porn or like OnlyFans or something. Porn, porn, Damn. real porn. Wow, it's an official deal. That's crazy, you know yo. I mean? That's crazy. I mean. Everybody do what they do, I guess, man. I but like, can't... some part of it is like he's either confused because, like I said, when he got jumped, she was with him, so he used to travel with her. She's cool enough to travel with, hang out with. Obviously, you smashing unprotected, 
but you don't accept her lifestyle. I can understand you don't accept it when she's pregnant, definitely, but like, that, that's just a messed up situation. Let me go back to something you said though. You said something about not, not having chicks with, with um having kids with chicks that you don't approve of, something like that. Sometime a joker slips up and has one with one that you wasn't really planning on having the one with. Now shit is different. Well, I definitely understand it. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking, I just had to clear that up I'm talking people. now as, yeah, like as to, somebody who's a little bit wiser Yeah, I just had to, I had to clear age. that up. I just had to make that clear I mean, sometime. When we was younger, of course, up, you know it was plenty saying? of chicks. Like, yo. Sometimes you make a mistake. I wish, I wish she better not be. You know what I mean? Just make a mistake sometime. But yeah, that that's, that's crazy, man, because... To me, I'm gonna say my. I, I feel like it's disrespectful no matter what. For, it, it, for her, for her, her, her behalf, it's, it's disrespectful no matter what. And like they say, sometimes two wrongs don't make it right. Because even if he did violate you a certain way, this this not only makes him look away, but it makes her look away. You know what I'm saying? It makes her look bad no matter what. Even if he smashed her sister behind the scenes, and we don't know about that. Even if we do find out about it, you doing this with Benny the Butcher and putting the picture out makes you look bad automatically. You know what I'm saying? Definitely. So I, I I feel like on her own sake she shouldn't have did this because it's just in this case two wrongs don't make because it right. The baby's probably so young, but when the baby yeah when gets the baby older, grows up and sees this, questions. like they're gonna be like, why would you? You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, once you part of growing up is realizing that everybody's an individual. Your parents, your friends, your cousins, your brothers, sisters, everybody's an individual. At the end of the day, the label that you have for them is only that's only one part of who they really are. You know what I'm saying? Like. You don't understand how your mom could have been a certain type of person. You you might not realize your mom could have been like maybe loose in the street. You know what I'm saying stuff like that. Mm, talk about it's it. It's not until you grow older and look at her as a human, as a regular person, you see the kind of men she might have messed with that you just seen her around, and you see the kind of stuff that she goes for. You, you might start putting two or three together. Like, damn, my mom is kind of, you know what I'm saying, a little off a little bit. I mean, she I seen her talking to Ricky last week. Now she's talking to Bobby. Oh shit. Mike was over here two days ago. You know what I'm saying? Like. She's Ricky, on it. Bobby? Ricky. Ricky, you know what I'm saying? And now, now I've seen her on the... So you got to cool it down. At that point, yeah, yeah, at that point, that's when you start realizing, yeah, my mom is an individual. She's my mom, but she has a whole different identity. You know what I'm saying? She mm. might be a smut out here in these streets. You know what I'm saying? So A lot of people don't even want to think about that, but... Realizations you got to come to sometimes. You know what I mean? So, And also, too, you know if your mom is attractive or not, or what she might have been. There's like a lot of things you can just see that you don't... If you look at... at Long story short, when you look at her as an individual, you might find some stuff out about your mom or whoever else like that you never really realized before. You got to look at it with a different lens. You know what I'm saying? You might find something. I think a lot of people, they don't really even want to try to look through that lens. They kind of just want to, you know what I mean, keep the mom category in the mom category and not really. Keep it safe. You know what I'm saying? Most people don't want it. Some moms, they don't don't give you no choice but to look in the other lens when you got moms like Black China's mom. Yeah, certain people and stuff. I know, definitely. What's her name? Ricky, uh, Frankie or something like that, right? I'm not sure. Yeah, I think think that's the one whose mom's name is Frankie. She's a beast. She's a beast, boy. She remind me of some of my aunts and stuff too, Frankie. I got a couple of aunts like Frankie. I think that's her name, Frankie. But yeah, man, that is crazy. Where to put that picture up with that boy like that? Disrespectful, man. But mm. it is what it is, man. Let us know what y'all think about that situation. Let us situation, know what y'all man. think about the situation. Would you do that?